For my personal safety, can I not have it recording? This sucks. Honestly, this sucks. Welcome back to another vlog, baby! I'll fill you guys in on where I'm going, what I'm doing. Like I said, I got a lot of explaining to do, but right now, I gotta catch my flight. Let's do it! Ever since this horrible pandemic hit the earth, I did not see myself traveling in the foreseeable future. But today, that all changes. This is freaking insane. There is... It's incredible. I've never been here with this amount of people. There's no one here. It's empty. It's so strange. So, so strange. Here's what's going down right now. So after I claim my baggage here at baggage claim number seven, I forget the terminal name. I have to go to terminal four to go get butter because that's where the cargo is delivered to. Hopefully everything's okay. I'll see you soon. This is actually super nice to see. They have these everywhere and they're full. All over the airport they have the hand sanitizer. So. The new normal. Yes. The new normal. <laughs> He's made like a barrier out of PVC pipe and then uh, some extra plastic to make a barrier. Tight fit, man. How are you doing in there? We're good, I think. I know she's obviously terrified right now, but as of right now, it looks like she's okay. And there's no poop or pee in here, so we're good. I did some research. We have to make our way to Terminal 2, to the Animal Bureau of Quarantine or something, and I have to get her exit papers from them. I mentioned this before, but we're gonna go to Terminal 2, and then we're going to Terminal 1, which is where my flight is with Pal. Philippine Airlines. That's that. I'll see you guys at Terminal 2. Animal Bureau of Quarantine? Opo. You can understand Tagalog? Kunti lang. Kunti lang? Kaliwa, Tereso. Kaliwa, Kanan. Ah, sige. So, this level? We've made it? We're... Oh, shit. Sorry, butter. We're at Terminal 2. This is where I gotta get butter. Paperwork. Not many people here either. It's quite nice. Hey, hey man. <laughs> so we have a little hiccup. Apparently I didn't even need to come to Terminal 2. They told me to go to Terminal 1. On the website it says that this is the only one. So I gotta take a taxi and we're going to Terminal 1. Oh, miss the eyes of the butter below. Wipe 
hours from waiting the passenger. <laughs> Ikaw? Hello, sir. Five hours? Yeah. Krabi. Krabi na, sir. Kuya just said he's been waiting five hours for a passenger. That's how not busy it is. This place is no deserted. More... Walang pasahero. Ah. Because COVID. Yeah, so there's like no international flights arriving. He said he's been waiting for five hours. This place is Very absolutely winter. deserted. Oh, you can tell she's so stressed. I feel so bad. imagine what it's like being in a cargo storage I don't even know if it's lit up like I don't know what it looks like I tried to google it but they don't have any pictures on the internet which probably isn't a good thing but it's just the way it is we're at the animal bureau entrance I just gave the guy some paperwork and we're waiting for that to get back and then I think we're good I, I want to say I'm shocked about how well behaved she is but I'm not She's just a good dog, like, hey, hey, what's that? Our tail's wagging. You, you. Water. We got our paperwork. This is gonna get butter into Canada. Yo, that's awesome. That's great news. So this is all I need to get her on the flight. Waking up in my bed, just as stuck in my head. I'm not even hungover. Ah. Ah. My face hurts. I'm wearing this mask. I didn't take it off for probably 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 7 hours. I've checked all my bags in, but they're just going to leave them behind the counter for us. Uh, so I can take butter for a little piddle and hang out for a bit because we still have like two hours before I have to check in. So we're gonna hang out here for a little bit. I'm gonna take her for a circle because I can't really take her for a walk. <laughs> this is the first time she's used this. This is hilarious. I have a hard time getting her to drink water, but it seems to work okay. This is literally the only place around her that has some grass. If she takes a dump, I got my dog baggies, because that's what you do. You pick up your dog's poo. Oh, by the way, they didn't let me bring my freaking suka. I brought like super nice artisanal suka as a pasalubang for, I bought it for my family and I had to ditch it at the freaking security guard. Because for whatever stupid reason, they don't allow it, nor are they allowing alcohol anymore. So if you have bottles of tandwai or whatever other great things you want to bring back, it's on their no list. That's what I was told. So I'm, I'm suka less. I feel like a papa. Wow, my child is doing so well. Stick in the pee. Benadryl. This is her relaxant. What the vet described me. So strange. I mean, I've never, ever, ever witnessed an AIA this quiet. I mean, again, it is sad because a lot of people either A, aren't employed, or B, you know, unable to travel home. So, it's kind of bittersweet. It's very peaceful, but it's really eerie. Anywho, as you guys can tell, I did change. I had a little, uh, a wet towelette shower in the bathroom. So I put my dirty clothes in a bag and then I threw it in my check bag. It was under the plane. So we're clean and we're feeling good. And butter, we're probably not doing so well, but that's okay. She'll get through it. 
I think we're boarding right now. I'm just gonna keep the rest of this super raw just to show you guys what it's like traveling during COVID, what the planes are like. If there is social distancing or not, I, I don't know. But this is gonna be interesting. Let's do it, baby. Honestly, the flight looks full. It's fully booked, so that means no social distancing, zero, nit nada, voila, nothing. I guarantee you I'm going to be sitting beside someone on this flight as is everyone else. It's fully booked. Huh? I already watched your YouTube. You're a subscriber? Yes. <laughs> I would high five you, but you know we can. That's awesome. Oh, yes. But having for the support. Uh, I appreciate it. Thank you. Hello. Do you have liquid to drink? Uh, too big lang. Awesome. Thank you. Hello. Okay, thank you. Uh. Okay, in all honesty, they said it was a fully booked flight, but I got a whole row to myself. All of the flight stewardesses have hairnets, pretty much a full bodysuit. Same getup as I got on, the mask with the the visor, the face shield. I think this is probably the only excuse you can have to take your mask and your shield up and off on the plane. I know I said I'd give you guys an explanation as to why I'm going home. Well, there's a few reasons, and I, I said that, but I need to sit down somewhere quiet where we can talk one on one people around because I don't want to be sharing my business with anyone but the Freddy gang. Even though that's a lot of people. We out here. So it's been... How did we leave? It's been about an hour. Almost exactly an hour. We got a meal. We got our first meal of the flight. What was the beef? We got a bun. We got a bun. Like feta salad. Everyone's got their masks and their eyewear off. I mean, you kind of have to. It's just a necessity to eat. Cheers to good health and good food in the future. Taking my mask off in here. This sucks. Honestly, this sucks. It's, the seats are so uncomfortable. I got like six pillows in behind my back to try to make it comfy. It's not comfy. This, I honestly, I think the worst thing about this is just so hard to breathe. And then trying to sleep, not getting that fresh air that you need. Or cold air at least. Like it's like you're breathing hot air the entire time. It sucks. We'll get through it. We'll get through it. We got, I don't know if that's the correct time now. I don't know what time it is, but. Oh,
What's that? You can log inside that crate. When you exit out, you can do an examination, then you can take a look. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, thank you. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I can't take her out yet. I gotta bring her to the examination room first. We did it! Hi, baby. I gotta leave you in there, okay? Good. I'm just gonna get my luggage. We have to go to the animal place. I have to give them all my paperwork regarding Butter's recent uh, rabies vaccines. Oh my gosh, she's actually using the water thing. Nice. So we got some more paperwork to process before we're free. Then we can hang out. Let's do this. Yeah, it's recording. What's that? For my personal safety, can I not have it recording? You can, but you're recording under people with this fault, and that's a Okay. Oh. 22 is good. Normally, there's a fee for the dogs, but we oh. just do it. Just for future reference, like the old, this is all that's required to bring it. Yeah, the baby's vaccination plus a health certificate. Okay, because I was worried because on the website it says something about teeter tests or something, but Canada, I guess, doesn't. No, I don't. Okay. Only look at a rabies vaccine. As okay. Long as it's still valid. All right. Thanks, sticker. That's it. Second on the left. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Thanks, man. My God, we have made it. Oh, the sweet smell of Canada. Let's go. Ah, all the laws and regulations are so different here in Canada. Like in the Philippines at Manila, I could let her pee, no problem. The security guards, the police, they don't care. But we're back in Canada, things are different. If I let her pee, I might get fined. Yeah, you got like, I don't know. Maybe 20 more minutes? Is that okay? I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, you take care. Have a good day. There you go. Thank you very much. Awesome. Oh, look at that! They even got a couple dog treats and some fresh water for her. That's wicked. Hi there, I was wondering if I could order room service. Thank you. 15% room charge? For them to bring it here? I forget how expensive it is here. <laughs> look at Butter, she's already asleep. Was the most poo little sandwich I ever paid $16 for. You guys, I'm literally running on two hours of sleep. I gotta get up at 5 a.m. for my next flight. I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Stay tuned for the bread and butter journeys. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button. Slap at the like button. If you enjoyed today's video, I'll see you in the next vlog. Later, gators. Body hurts. Yeah, body freaking hurts.